Kia ora te whanau. this is a short video on how to make course selections. Our vision is that everyone learns. This is encompassed by our three values, whanaungitanga, kōtahitanga and manakitanga. You can see within that there are clear statements around what we aspire to for our young people. The other night we had an open night. At this uh, we handed out a planning tool course selection planning booklet for year nines. All students are required to take courses that involve each of the learning areas listed in this slide. We believe that students have to make a lot of choices in life, so why not start at year nine? Students with your guidance can choose courses that align with their interests and passions. You will notice in the booklet that each of the learning areas have courses underneath. So arts has Who Am I, Photographic Production Arts, English and Author's Voice, Belonging, Book Club. Health and PE, Health and PE, I like to move at Mathletes and so on. So your child will do eight courses based on the learning areas. A course is made up of two terms. This is what we call semester one. To read more each, about each course, you need to look at our online tool, School Point. Search in Google or type in the URL listed. If you have enrolled with us, you will have received an email giving the details of how to log in to School Point. You will not be able to select courses unless you have this. You will also have to select what your leaving intentions are. So just click on returning to Marlborough Girls, even though we know you haven't started yet. On the left hand side, there's a navigation bar. Click on learning areas and this will bring all of the learning areas you can choose from. If you click on the English semester one, it will bring up all the different courses available for you. You'll notice a nine in front of some of them. These are courses for year nine students only. A 10 means they're for year 10 students only. And a nine 10 means year nine or 10 can choose this. And it's great to see the connections students can make across the year levels. Similarly in the arts, these courses are available for year nines. These are nines and tens, and these are tens only. As you explore School Point, start to look at your planning tool and tick the ones you really like. And you'll have a range of them. And then make a little cross by the ones that you're not really interested in. You can also see what's available in Semester 2. Please note that some courses are only available for Semester 1. So if you're keen on one of them, you must take it in Semester 1. Once you're ready to make your final decisions, write these in your booklets and make sure you have covered each of the learning areas. Put a little tick. Note that some courses may cover more than one learning area. Once you've made all those decisions, you're now ready to enter. You've logged on. So for English, you've decided you want to do book club. Click on book club and then it will take you to a little screen that looks like this and it's as simple as clicking on the green button. Remember, you need to select eight courses. In science, you decide you want to do Our Forest Treasures. Again, click on this. It brings up this screen for you to click the green button. You also want to do Train to Gain. You like the idea of exploring health and PE and science together. Note, this is a combo class of 9 and 10 learners, and that's fine. Again, use the green button to select as one of your courses. Don't worry, if you make a mistake or change your mind, you can remove your courses from either your course summary. You will get a list of all the courses you've chosen, which makes it easy to track. Final check. Firstly, you won't be able to choose your courses unless you've enrolled. Select at least one course from all learning areas and take a backup. And don't panic. If you can't do it online, just hand in the booklet to our front desk. Annie will look after.